In March 2024, Trump said about the auto industry in America, if he did not get elected, quote, it's going to be a bloodbath for the country. Let me tell you something to China. If you're listening, President Xi, and you and I are friends, but he understands the way I deal, those big monster car manufacturing plants that you're building in Mexico right now, and you think you're going to get that, you're going to not hire Americans, and you're going to sell the cars to us now, we're going to put a 100% tariff on every single car that comes across the line, and you're not going to be able to sell those cars. If I get elected, now if I don't get elected, it's going to be a bloodbath for the whole, that's going to be the least of it. It's going to be a bloodbath for the country. That'll be the least of it. But they're not going to sell those cars. They're building massive factories. He's talking about a bloodbath for America. It's laid out in the terms of it. And these idiots uh, on Twitter, uh, these idiots uh, on, 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 on cable news, these idiots on Sunday shows, going, well, yeah, well, presidents, you know, he was talking only about the auto industry. And this is one more. It's just bullshit. Every single Republican that is asked is going to try to spin it and pretend that it really had nothing to do with a real bloodbath. Democrats use the same bloodbath term about everything. Politico.com reports tonight on the, quote, bloodbath at the RNC. Headlines calling it a, quote, bloodbath. A bloodbath. Not only is it going to be a bloodbath, but after they leave New Hampshire, it's a bloodbath on her home turf. That's really and tough. Trump has left a lot of corpses in his wake. I mean, we yeah. can count the bodies as part of the, quote, MAGA drive to take over Maricopa County. And the headline refers to it as an impending bloodbath. Columnist Charles Blow has a new piece for The New York Times entitled A Biden Bloodbath. 2018 midterms, you can bet that they 100 percent are fearing a slaughter. In fact, yeah. the word blood. Yeah and massacre come up frequently. The Republican Party will be destroyed. It's going to be a bloodbath. There's going to be a bloodbath one way or the other. Bloodbath blood for Bernie Sanders. It's been a bloodbath there, shaping up to be a bloodbath. Head off a bloodbath in next year's crucial midterm. Off-year elections are often a bloodbath. This week's bloodbath for Democrats, a bloodbath at the ballot box. There could be a Republican bloodbath. They'll talk about a bloodbath. It's a bloodbath. I have to talk about you. And it's going to be a bloodbath all day long. Is in for a bloodbath. It hasn't been a bloodbath on the way down. Donald Trump bloodbath be a bloodbath. Predicted to be a bloodbath. May not be the bloodbath. It would be a bloodbath. More of a bloodbath. It's going to be a bloodbath in November. Possible Biden bloodbath this November. A bloodbath on Wall Street. There's going to be a bloodbath in, in Alabama into a bloodbath. Obviously, there was a bloodbath. It was a bloodbath. We're down 800 points. This bloodbath at Department of Homeland Security. And it's a bloodbath today. There was going to be this bloodbath. Election bloodbath. It, it could be a bloodbath for them. Bloodbath, possibly. Bloodbath that went through with the attorney general. Bloodbath 99 days out. The bloodbath is going to look like presided over a bloodbath in the diplomatic corps. Salute, in my opinion, blood black, blood bloodbath the Democrats are calling it a ticket sales turned into a bloodbath. Ticket sales for singer Taylor Swift's latest tour. It's safe to say the fans had a, a bloodbath for the company after the fiasco. Telling the truth matters. The Bible tells us that there is a bloodbath that we all need. Unto him that loved us and washed us from our sins in his own blood and has made us kings and priests unto God his father to him be glory and dominion forever and ever. If we walk in the light as he is in the light, we have fellowship with one another, and the blood of Jesus Christ, his Son, cleanses us from all sin. If we say that we have no sin, we deceive ourselves, and the truth is not in us. If we confess our sins, he is faithful and righteous to forgive us our sins and to cleanse us from all unrighteousness. God commends his love towards us, in that while we were still sinners, Christ died for us. Much more than being now justified by his blood, we shall be saved from judgment through him. For God so loved the world that he gave his only begotten Son, that whosoever believes in him should not perish, but have everlasting life. Please take a moment, bow your head and your heart, and pray these words with me. God, I come to you in Jesus' name. Please forgive all of my sins. I turn away from them this day. I believe Jesus died on the cross for me and rose again to save me. Lord Jesus, come into my heart. Apply your blood to my account. I trust you, and your sacrifice on the cross was enough for me. Write my name in the book of life. Fill me with your Holy Spirit and give me wisdom. Father God, I am your child. 
Thank you for saving me and making me ready for heaven. In Jesus' name I pray. Amen.